build. Hmm. Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and welcome back to Ostrov. Um, I've recorded episodes 3, 4, and 5 today, and I'm working on 6 now, so all of these have been in the same day. So if you've been leaving comments, you know, be aware I won't be able to, to mention anything in future episodes about your comment just yet. I just saw someone pull a card out of there. Interesting. So it is convenient for them to do that. Okay. Well, let's order another cart. Got a well going over there, which I want to pause. We saw that other well get built when it was clear in the back of the queue. When I was waiting for whatever building it was over here. So let's make sure that doesn't happen again. And this over here still has a cart in it. Where else would be convenient to have a cart? Um, in fact, I was just editing episode 3. And when I put that in, I realized I also said it might be good to put one over here. Uh, I was just hearing one being built over there. And he did the same thing as then. <laughs> Finished the, worked on the cart and then went off and took a break. And we didn't get to see it uh, get put away then either. Hmm. You know something I haven't done in all these episodes? I made a note of it, I think the very first one, but these three tabs aren't being used yet. So work in progress. So if all this time you've been waiting for me to click on one of those, that's, that's what's up there. Once I realized that, I just tuned them out. I don't even think about them anymore. Are you going back to work on that? You are. Let's watch this in a slower, well, it's not as exciting slower. But that's how you build a cart, everybody. You know, just in case you uh, didn't know, you just, you just hit it with a hammer a whole bunch of times. <laughs> and we're going to deliver it? We are not. Where are you going? Oh, we're going this way. Uh, one. And follow. Uh, there you are. <laughs> yeah, follow. I guess maybe you follow when the cam is up like this. It would step back a little bit. That feels better. So we'll do this and speed it up. We are delivering this cart to here. Good parking. Now we are heading back to work. Unfollow. Thank you. All right. Anything yet? No. Why? I wish I knew. It doesn't make sense. We are nails, wood, clay. What is that symbol right there next to the wood? Is that important? I don't know. Wood, 200. And you... Our pause hauling flour on the cart. Oh, okay. Now back to this, and I'm sure some of you have already answered the question I had long ago. What are these? So you are laborer by cart. I mean, why wouldn't I click all of them? Why wouldn't I be willing to, you know, have it delivered in every way possible? Eventually, apparently by, by wagon. I don't know how that works. You are... Holds up to four carts. Um, builds carts, wagons, plows, and simple furniture. So eventually we're going to see wagons. I don't know what building they would be associated with at this point. Okay. So, yeah, why wouldn't we want all resources checked? I did get three? I did. I mean, on all buildings. What buildings supply that? So, oh, as soon as I did that, all the labor's filled in. Interesting. So, all of these laborers are assigned to bring all this wood over. Wow. And they're boom, 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 boom. Bring it over and it's done. Okay. And apparently that one as well. You are, where are you? Right there. You're bringing over all the flour. 
So this one doesn't give me, yes it does. All right, I want all of you guys to just get this stuff back over there real quick and haul it all in. Okay, so that's gotta be thought about. What is the advantage or disadvantage of that? I mean, you're tying up your, your laborers from the harvest now because they're off doing all these other jobs and the harvest is gonna suffer or these are going to suffer. I still don't have any laborers, so I've got a builder coming out here to finally install all this stuff. Thank you. But I don't have uh, we may not have any laborers to do construction projects because they're all hauling flour. I don't know. But um dude. <laughs> It's really hard in Banished to get buildings built in the winter because it's such a long walk to a place and it's cold, so they've got to go warm up. This game doesn't give you the message it has to go warm up. Right? I've never seen that. Nah, I don't get the sense that that's a thing. Maybe that's what's happening in the background, though. I don't know. Huh not going to supply you like the other ones until we actually do something with it but I feel like we're really at a standstill because I don't want to divert labor anymore until this job gets done but nobody wants to walk out this far in the winter and we could probably have this thing long since built so I just do it messenger is visiting now whoa okay right there um, click on it. Offers flour, cow, and iron. Demands potato. Visiting for 16 more days. That's, it says that he's visiting us. Message is gone. Uh, where am I? Right here. Trader. That doesn't tell me. Okay. Well, we don't have potatoes to, to give them, unfortunately. So, back to here. So, visiting for 16 more days. These, nothing, nothing. What I don't understand, is this their messenger? Or is it the one that we sent? It looks like, I can't zoom any further, but there's a symbol right there. Is our guy, did he just arrive there and we're getting the message back? Or did they send one as well and we're going to get another offer when he returns? Visiting for 15 more days. Well, need advanced potatoes. I click on that. Sell potatoes to Balik Balakia. Balakia. There we go. And we don't have any. So price per unit, eight deal now well, flour offers flour or cow amount bulls oxen hmm and iron ah so this is how we get our iron okay I'm guessing that everybody has got wheat and flour and so there's no point in trying to sell them our wheat and flour and wood and firewood and thatch <laughs> yeah so we may not as you know no reason to send more messengers out till we have something a little more you know exotic a little more complex to sell that's kind of feeling that way Coming at the end of February, we're starting to see some melt. What were we hoping to get done this winter and didn't? <laughs> okay, let's just shove this over there and get that done. They're not going to make the trip, right? We have a laborer trying to deliver two clay. Clay, that's right. I had some notes here. One was to check the messenger and the other was to put more clay in. I was going to do that at the very beginning, one there and one over here, to help build these houses. 
that would have sped up the process to at least one of the steps could be you know very quick delivery we could be quickly delivering here and over here let's there there let's clay into here four more trees okay let's yeah we'll do that so shift do that and I still have another oh can I I got the door on the wrong side yes I did well let's not make that mistake again the other one was down here and I really can't oh, I can go right here though hmm is there any advantage to that I mean the clay is going to be delivered here and I don't know what else is going to be built in this area let's just try to remember to do that the next time we start a new area to build in lumber is there thatch has a long distance to go I don't see the need though to pop another thatch producer in and one smithy should be all we'll ever need hmm okay well let's kick that speed back up again there's not much we can do with the messenger unfortunately now let's view this 180 nails waiting for 20 nails so I never really looked at the oh because there's no way to look at it uh, transportation is here yeah this when we built it it gave us a, a grand total of what it was going to be needed but it, there's no way to look at that again so so far, so far we brought 200 nails and bringing 10 wood over here we're still just dead in the water for a while at least until this is built. I have a feeling this is going to build quite fast. Except for when he needs to take a break. Um, the nails will do all the planks. The wood is probably the supports or something like that. Okay. You know, I didn't really look up to see what time I started this episode. Hmm. Well, it's going to be an unknown length. Um, everything's being held up right here. It really is. That is frustrating that they we had so much resistance here. Let's swap that back out again. Let's go to this one real quick. And just the nails and nobody's assigned to it. Let's go off to this one. Nobody's assigned to it. There's been a lot of resistance to this building site. We do have planting going on, right? Was I just noticing that? Field, nutrients. Let's uh, slow down a moment. I've not got a bar here. We have two laborers. They started on this one. Oh, fallow, fallow. Oh, okay. So you are hemp. Skipped the plowing as we can't yet. Um, have not started sewing that way. Did start sewing this one, and looks like we'll probably dive into this next. Okay, so we're going to get the sewing done early. Now, over here, we've said go ahead and haul everything. But I'm not seeing a whole line of laborers, you know, lined up ready to haul all the stuff, so that's not happening. Uh, these we're done once all that stuff got delivered it was finished so what kind of numbers we're looking at reserve so there's more being brought over so there's one whole fish something and 1.3 flour or something units bags sacks um pallets maybe that'll work fish okay we've gone past the 0.9 level that we couldn't break through last time this one's still stuck at the 0.9 hmm female 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 so we've not swapped out laborers on its own they're still who I put in there um, the only name I remember is Marina yeah if Marina and I may have been, been mis mispronouncing that the entire time do we have anybody walking out this direction yet we have a laborer bringing more clay okay and yeah that's gonna boy I wish I had turned that oh well that clay is right there. Okay, path. There you are. What are you doing? You're going off to get this cart. 
and then hopefully you're going off over here and not all the way back over there all right fishing that's right we have some spring duties by not keeping these guys employed the whole time we uh we've got to be responsible enough to uh get in there and, and remember to do that there's still stored fish so we didn't actually run out so i'm going to do just the two workers but not unemploy them throughout the entire season just let them let them have the whole run of it all right speed it back up let's we got lots of sewing going on these two are going to be fallow so they can be sunflower next time potato is coming into here i can't change this now can i i cannot <clears throat> hmm and i cannot deactivate i can because they're fallow slow down now i'm wondering if we want more potatoes really do let's put another field in let's unassociate you well if it's deactivated field one and two well deactivate those let's add another field and where to we'll grab the corner snaps right there one two three space one two three so one two three space that's about it right there hmm let me i gotta zoom out here there we go snap one two three space one two three we wanted 25. that'll do and you now can I switch you? Oh, that's how it works. That's what we what, what we blew last time. Let's potato you and activate. And let's do one more over here and sunflower this one and activate. And then we can get our variety in right off the bat. Okay, I'm getting excited now. Um, farm and field this corner. snaps right there okay we'll do that you're going to there you're 27 hmm all right that'll do doors right there okay you are going to be sunflower and then we will activate so at this point we still have six fields that are active there's eight fields now and a farm can handle six from my understanding it would be smart to get another farm over here and split these up so the labor can be working in two different places and have another community over here of housing and market and and food sources and things like that so maybe this is where we're going next maybe another community over here with farms all through the central area and our fields and two main farm hubs handling them all I can see that happening. I just can't see accomplishing building them <laughs> so far away. How would we deal with that? I guess we got to get the houses out here first. So people are already located in this area. Hmm. Well, after these three, I guess three more right down in here would be a good idea. Once I figure out how the cow shed works, how much room is needed? Is there any room needed? I've never built one of these. All right, speed back up, and that's interesting. So we've got a whole new set of uh, of uh, rules going on here, or uh, you know, we're accomplishing more goals than I had dreamed that I was going to be. Let's see, right click to remove. We can't do any of that. We're waiting for the sewing to begin. So this one is about there. That one, that one's done. So we got a long way to go yet. And do we have the laborers to do it? We don't. Yeah, let's not limit that anymore. We need to get this accomplished. Well, I wish I'd thought of that uh, 20 days ago. Hmm. Okay. We got this brought over. And we're waiting for a worker. The story of my ostrich life waiting for a worker 
<laughs> Do you have some logs stored in here though now? And he's flipped all the way over like this because in the spring the winds must come from this direction. Which we are... Let's see here. Zoom out. Comparing to the mini-map there. We're kind of like this. So I guess in the spring the wind comes from... Which way are those bent? One. I can't see the twist in it. Okay, so it hits and pushes this way. So the wind is coming from this direction. Which, what did I say? Let me get back to that river. Um, something like that. So, northeasterly. That's where the winds are coming in in the spring. Ah, interesting. I want it'll be interesting to see if it tracks that through the year. Ends up over here for the winter. Okay, I'm just I'm just stalling. I'm trying. I'm waiting for this to get done. But I don't want to just you know go to three speed and, and sit here and do nothing when there's so many other things we could be doing. So over here, will you look at that? It just kind of dawned on me what I'm seeing here. These are trees or poles, and they're thinner at the top and thicker at the bottom. The hole in the roof of all four poles will slide up as the hay builds, so that as more room is needed, the roof lifts. Now, I want to know who gets up there and lifts that thing. I wonder, you know, if there was pulleys and ropes coming down, that would be interesting. Four people heave ho at the same time and lifts it up. I don't know how that how that would raise. Hmm. Maybe we'll, we'll next year or the end of this year see the animation of it as they load it. Does it just lift or does does someone run out here with a big ladder and pops it up alongside? And yeah, we'll see. Now these guys are they're angled toward the sun. Oh, that must be the random angle I happened to be at when I laid them down. Okay, they rotate. So it's not toward the sun, it's just the way I happened to, to lay it down. Labor is bringing... Mm, you dropped off your cart? Okay, so I guess that's the end of the clay. Now that that phase is done, hopefully a worker will jump in there. Fishing is kind of happening. Thatching is definitely happening. So I wonder if there's a capacity in here. And do we ever see anything stored? Not really. That'd be a generic graphic right there. There's boxes and barrels. Nothing stored in here that looks like thatch or logs or wood. Okay. So, yeah, we don't get to see it all piling up in here like we see the logs coming into here. Now, I think that's the actual wood that they bring out. There's firewood piling up right there. We get a little bit of an angle there. Oh, they were filling up a cart. Okay. But I'm thinking I've seen this empty before. But the logs are obvious. We're really loading that up. So we've got two guys working in here. We do. And they are managing to hit just about their max on their entire queue here. So I'm trying to remember all the updates that have happened that I've seen come across Twitter. Seems like I saw that when a worker is no longer working, he will jump into, into labor. But I'm not certain about that. Now these need to go away for this building site, right? Windmill? No. Did we manage to miss it? No, they've already taken them out. There's only two left there. Whoa. Three left there. Okay. So they did clear that out. Good. So they could start building this at some point. Now over here... Do we get any sense this has changed? Not really other than supplies have been brought over. Will the cow shed ever be built? 
That is the question of the episode. Another fisherman going out. Running at two speed. We're in April. We're watching the sewing. Oh, okay. Pretty obvious there's something growing in here. You are hemp. The other hemp is here. We're sewing this one. Your potatoes. Okay. All the little bit potato plants in there. You are sunflower. Be interesting to watch the graphics on this to see if the sunflowers track the sun during the day. Well, okay. There's no sun movement in the game. Never mind. <laughs> Farming simulator I'm thinking of where you can watch them track the sun. Uh, you were potatoes and you are sowed or sown. And we've got wheat. And you are too. And we can see it there. Okay. Although that looks a lot like that. I wonder if it's the same graphic right now for the baby plants. This one's obviously different. But these two look awfully similar. We'll wait till they get bigger. We can see them better. So you were sunflower and we have not started yet. You were potato and you have been started. Okay. All right. Has my stalling paid off? Those look like the same numbers. Something is going wrong here. Something's going wrong. And it's, it's holding up everything else. Okay, well, I guess we're going to go without plowing for a while. I want to get all these in. I really do. I'm going to unpause you. You're in the back. You're next. Let's just get you done. We've got plenty of wood. Um, can I do anything to speed this up? So we've got, you know, supply, resource supply here. I don't have that here. So I can't get more help to just spread this stuff out all over. Messenger is visiting. All right. And over here, over here. The same demand. So I wonder if that is never going to change. And that looks like a horse and it is still in the same place as before. So that must not be the same one that we did. Okay. So I don't know what else to make of that. We don't have potatoes so we can't fulfill the order. But we're going to have potatoes. Big time. In fact, let's just say that uh, you know we want potatoes in we can't because we don't have any yet we can bring in wheat though let's bring in 20 wheat get that hauled now we're into May we're still doing the planting we're a long way away though but we're still getting the planting done. Just wondering if we're pulling laborers away by those settings that we did. But I think that was kind of a one-time thing, and then just very, you know, once in a while, they, they fill them back in. How's fish doing over here? We were at 0 0.6, now we're at 0 0.1. Interesting, because we're having a hard time getting anybody out there. All right, we'll put three in there. This has done so well, I think we're going to have to just kind of pull these guys out and spread them around the map a little bit better. All right. Lots of laborers. Need a worker for here. We just fired these two, but none of them jumped into that slot. Bet you they all became fishermen. No, they didn't. Well, Thatch is doing fine. We're going to fire you. And we've already tossed the uh, the blacksmith. I don't know where else to gain skilled workers. Well, there's one. So hopefully he can... Can he actually finish the job? Nope, there's a thatch delivery. It's got to come in, and it's not here yet. So there's at least two more phases of worker. And he walked so far. I'm curious to see... If he's going to be able, come on, hopefully you deal with the nails, not just the clay. 
Okay, it's looking good. Clay. All right, we're putting up the last of the walls. A little window in there. All right, now, after you're done with these last two clay, please move into wood and nails. Don't leave, don't leave, don't leave. Hmm, well, I guess that was the mason. Now we're waiting for a carpenter to show up or something. <laughs> you are so hard to get a hold of. All right, there. It would be nice to see a list of skills. You know, he works with clay kind of a thing. All right, waiting for the next... Although that's over here. Over here. Did you... No, laborer is bringing more wood. So wood seems to be the holdup. We've done a little bit. The nails didn't go away. Hmm. You are my laborer, right? Your worker. Ah, just assigned. Okay. Well, let's watch this. I like how they bring the whole railing over at once. <laughs> there we go. Well, we'll let that run for a while. I can even look at this from there. From here. Nice. Now here, we've got no fish coming in. We've run out. Okay. Market stalls. Uh, no, you're buried way back in there. We're actually starting to run a little bit low on fish. We're not above one anymore. Interesting. Hmm. Wood. Already down to 150. Well, let's take it down to 100, then we'll have to hire them back again. Fields. This is the one I'm concerned about. It is sown. It's the sunflowers. And it's the same little graphic. So yeah. We uh we've got we will have more graphics coming, I'm guessing. But uh, right now they're they're placeholders. Okay. Bridge is almost done though. I see there's there's no separate phases. The whole thing is wooden nails. Ten more wood coming. It's almost like it's ten wood for each section. So ten and ten. So twenty more wood ought to do this job. It would be nice to have a a master plan somewhere in this box. Here's the total amount of building supplies needed, and then chip away at it as they get brought over. That would be nice. Gives you a little more information. So here are the the hay dryers. Grass four. And that's the drying process. Is that what I'm getting out of that? When this is done, then they can be loaded in. And if they're done early enough in the year, will we get a second phase out of it? That's possible. I think there would be enough time, really, in May. Maybe we can get several rounds out of this. Her tapping. Ten more wood. So each of these little things, so ten, ten, and ten. Wow. So you're probably actually running low. You are. Okay. Yep, we need to get to these houses. We really do. In fact, this bridge is probably more of a luxury than anything. It's not truly needed. I just wanted to see it. But in reality, we really need those houses going. I need more labor out here. And I wish I knew why the wheat was... Turn that speed down to one. Hmm. One mil. Click it again. We're kind of vibrating there. Why is that? What are you guys actually doing? We're awaiting three wheat. So three wheat's being delivered. So they're not actually doing any delivering on their own anymore. Interesting. What do we have here? We had 21. Hmm. And the vibrating was while it was being delivered, wasn't it? Maybe I don't want... Maybe I do want them to pick up their own stuff. Worker by cart, not laborer. Otherwise, they're just sitting here really not doing anything. So let's free up the laborers. 
and the laborers are available to be bringing resources to all of these jobs. Is that all that I, I also did here? Yeah, let's do that. Now, I would assume that the boat maker would have a similar, and he was just a worker by cart. Okay. Should I not say, yeah, windmill, get rid of worker by hands. They don't carry very much on their own. They carry a point one. So, same thing here? Have you take it by cart and get a whole bunch at once? Let's do that and see what happens over the course of the, of the game. Just by cart. So you can get a large quantity at once rather than lots of little trips bringing just point ones each time. Okay, I like that. Speed it back up. And we've got one person back in here. One can do an awful lot with 13 logs stored, or 9 logs stored. One can just keep grabbing logs and tossing them in. Don't have to uh, to go out and get the logs, which is a two-person job. Though I see two people in there now. But yeah, they're just bringing it back and forth, and, and they're going to fill that right back up. Okay. You are almost done. Be nice to see how that uh, uh, how that process works. <laughs> it's still, yeah, okay. So I can't help but think that if I move that over, though we're not doing anything over here either. So we're having a distance problem. That's what I'm going to have to assume. What if I, well, I can't even get that house built. I was going to say, what if I got a house built over here? before we continued any more projects off in the distance, but really that's what we're doing is the house over here. <sighs> this is truly an island, right? Yeah. So by hooking this up, we're not going to you know, connect us to the other side of the map any, any faster, make it easier for something else to happen. Okay, and our map, everything is to this side, right? Not necessarily. We're on this little tiny river. We're on that river, right in here. Okay. Hmm, so really it's, it's all directions. Okay, now eventually we're going to see... Um, trading by river. Like that's why everybody is on a a river route. Oh, I see you have to go around and come back in. We're not really connected. So by ocean as well. And then boat it in up the river. Okay. No horse symbol now. So only when a messenger arrives. Alright, so You're ready. Are we going to see this before this episode, or is this a next episode thing? I'm kind of thinking it's a next episode thing. Let's one last little walk through, and... Where are you going? You're getting a cart. And getting a cart. Yeah, let's kind of... Although you are dropping things off over in there. Though there's nothing there that's new. So that's just simulating it. It's not actually happening. Okay. So, yeah, maybe next episode we'll get started right here and see if we can watch the animations, but I don't know when that's going to be. We're in June. Um, we're seeing our growth. Yeah. This sounds like a good place to call this one done. So, it's been Noble Rambler. Thank you guys for watching, and I will catch you next time. Bye-bye.